Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Demons crest, 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 crest. Crest lightning. Don't buy the toothpaste. That won't be the best. Crest isn't. You don't like crest. What do you use? Are you sensitive? I said don't buy the toothpaste. That won't be the best. I didn't say I don't like crest. Oh, that was just a fake slogan you were coming yeah. up with for crest. Yeah, exactly. It's fucking toothpaste. Whatever. Crest. Just like the rest. Crest, <laughs> crest, just like the rest. It's toothpaste, dude. What yeah. are you looking for? Put it on your toothbrush. You what does Sensodyne do? Uh, it doesn't have SLS in it. What's SLS? Uh, sodium lauryl sulfate. What the fuck is that? It gives you canker sores. Really? It's an it's an inactive ingredient. Oh it boy! It, it makes it bubble. Okay, this is uh, this is definitely doing something here. All right. So to explain, this game is uh, this it's is Demon's the, Crest. It's the prequel to Gargoyle's Quest. It's uh, Ghosts and Goblins related, right? Yeah, yeah, this is Red Armor. It's the boss from Ghosts and Goblins? Yeah, well he wasn't a boss, he was just an enemy that showed up. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> he's like, ah, stop! Just, he's, he's, like, already, ah, he's, stop. he's already all gross anyway. Why is, he, why is he so upset about a little fire? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? It's like you've, you've been rotting for what appears to be a decade or so. Or maybe he's like oversensitive, you know when you like get a bruise and he you're like, don't touch it please. It hurts. Yeah, he needs some Sensodyne <laughs> for that wound. Some Sensodyne toothpaste? Yeah. Good old Sensodyne. Is it Sensodyne for sensitive teeth? Yeah. But for teeth only. It strengthens it's enamel or I don't joke. fucking know. Well, he needs a few str- <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna peek out, just you look out! He wants to, but he can't. Oh, How can they make a rotting dragon look cute? Still gotta beat him. I'm gonna punch the shadow. <laughs> he's still trying his hardest, his damnedest. <laughs> yeah, he is! I love how this- oh, he's rotting even more? Yeah, well, he's dead now. He's he's like, he looks like super rot- well, if he, he was dead before, so is he not dead still? No, he's like, undead, living dead. The Night of the Dead? I guess there's like three forms. There's living, and then unliving, and then dead. Oh, okay, just... so you just figured out the headbutt really quick. I do what? Uh, so you can headbutt stuff in the background. Like that? Yeah. So like statues and windows and stuff, oh. you can headbutt them. Oh, Shit cool. Comes out. All right, basically, uh, we, we, we played this game a while ago, and I didn't much like it, so I'm giving it another chance. What? Oh. Yeah, so you can jump and like hover. The, yeah. the graphics look cool, but the game feels a little off. Um, it's slow, but it's slow for a reason. Alright, we'll see. You get, like, different forms later. Oh, that's right. There was some stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love that shit. Headbutt. Oh, bam! Oh, bam! And the fucking giant dragon statue in the background that's like, I'm gonna get you, but you're a little far away! <laughs> I know! I would get- I would get you, I would get you. You're just a little far I've been close. petrified, so if you, if you could come closer and just step inside my claw, I could say that I got you to my friends. Oh, that guy? Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's like, do you know what it's like to be the fucking enemy that can't move and get the guy? I <laughs> can't get the guy. You know how much my friends make fun of me? All my friends are like, I just got three dragons today. I don't take up one. It's like, oh, I killed fucking Mario Luigi like seven times today. What'd you do? <sighs> <laughs> I watched him go by. No, no, I got one, I got one. Uh, yeah, what'd you get? The air? <laughs> what'd you get? A slug that meandered into your paw? <laughs> yeah, look, he's got a slug mark on him. <laughs> he's just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're making fun of my slug mark. <laughs> I got that slug mark from my mom. <laughs> Ew. I think you need to go up. Okay. You need to go up that wall. Which to the wall? right. On the right. Just go up the wall on the right. Ring. This one? Go ahead and, yeah. Because you can jump off. Alright. I think you can just jump from the skulls on oh. Yeah, there you go. Alright. Give him a little headbutt. The, the graphics look nice. The... Or not. It's sort of... What do you mean? It's... I can't remember. Oh, wait. Yeah, what you, maybe I have to destroy this. Maybe. Oh, it, it's kind of Castlevania-ish. It is a bit. Wait, try to go right again? I don't remember that happening. How far can I do that for? Uh, did, maybe Ever? forever, yeah. The game's like designed around it though, so you get to levels where like it seems like you're like, I'm invincible, but you're not. Uh, let's see. Oh wait, isn't that dragon like something? Maybe. Try to go back to it, I guess. It's weird that I don't remember what to do in this first stage. I just played this like a month, like two months ago. Mm. Why are you <laughs> why are you just why are you just Taking a stroll. <laughs> I want to see if there's something over here because it gave me a high platform to jump. Oh, from. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Some right. like braid shit. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I guess like the the, the cloud, cloud that, that moves a you. pixel a second. Oh Jesus. <laughs> oh boy. 
Maybe you do go up there. Was that a, what was that? What was what? What is that? That? Nope. No. I just keep going right, I guess. Oh, okay. God damn it. What happened? <laughs> this guy's a fucking. Ow, ow, my toe! No, he's just like, ah, gotcha! 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 <laughs> I can't. <laughs> <laughs> he does his little celebration. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, at least he can find happiness in death. <laughs> you loved it. <laughs> not, I love when you get fucking like, oh. <laughs> well, I mean, he's cheering about his triumph. I think everybody should enjoy a little bit oh, of shit. life, even, <laughs> if they, even if they're not in life right Dude, now. Dude, fuck that. I think most people should just get over it already. It's not gonna get better. So just keep. Yeah, just go. Oh, uh, did I not? Did I not? <laughs> yeah, try yeah I guess. I guess you didn't. Oh, yeah, go ahead and go boy. ahead and headbutt little gargoyle, man. I think I'm gonna get pretty gosh darn panned for that one. <laughs> okay, all right, I guess I gotta move away from him. This is a good guy. Is this turning into uh, yeah. Alexander Graham Bell? Okay, no, that's not. It looked like a profile of a head to me. Really? Yeah, a little bit. Alexander Graham Bell. I was trying to think of something like George I mean, the, Washington. The, the inventor of the telephone. How do you know that? Uh, school. Were you there for that? <laughs> did, they, did somebody call you up on a telephone and tell you that? In, in, in a, in a, <laughs> ring, ring, hello. Yeah, I invented this. <laughs> in a, in a, actually, that was just on a Doctor Who episode I, I was watching. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Alexander Graham, like, Bell, like, gets crossed, the lines get crossed with on the cell phone, and he's like, first telephone call, Alexander Graham Bell. <laughs> it's like, I can't wait till you're David Tennant. <laughs> Eccleston's not that bad. I don't know. I just everyone's always like, just wait till tenant. I'm like, I'm fucking waiting. I just, I just started watching it. Ow! Burn, bitch. Yeah, sit, sit. Kind of hurt. Enjoy, and, enjoy that victory because it's not. It gets harder. It is the harder ones. And then I just headbutt him again. <laughs> I'll blam him. Oh yeah, jeez. Isaac's smoking. <laughs> what, what? So what's the deal with like? So oh, he was oh. stone before, and then he turned into a normal dude. And then he became stone again, and then, and then you could headbutt him? Like, maybe you need to headbutt him when he's, like, hot stone, so it's, like, a, oh, a chain like, reaction like, Do you remember in Fantastic Four when it was, like... I did not. This is, like, the second goddamn time you brought up Fantastic Four today? Really? I'm a little sick of it! What? No, it's not. Oh, yeah. yeah. As a Mr. Fantastic, yeah. that's right. Um, no, then the, the movie... How do you fucking... You can't. <gasps> you can't. Forget it! You can't. You can't do it. You can't. Can't do it. Okay. You get an ability that lets you stu shoot stuff on the ground. <laughs> you can't do it right now. All right. What are we talking about? Uh, there's like a running gag in there that's like, you know what happens when you super cool something that's a thousand million degrees? He's like, no, and then, and, then, and then he does it, and then it makes him break or something. Wait, it's what? Like, it's like that. What? There's a, there's a, like a running gag in the Fantastic Four where like, they're they're both physicists, Doctor Doom and uh, Mister Fantastic. Yeah. And they have like this thing where it's like, do you know what happens when you super cool something at extreme temperatures? And it's like, oh, it breaks. Like, and that's that's how the movie ends. Really? Yeah. Wait, he, why like, does gets, the movie end that way? He gets like super hot because of like some flaming torch or whatever, and oh. they cool him down and whatever. That movie's actually a guilty pleasure for me. I gotta it say. Has yeah, it's it's a really yeah. stupid movie, but like somehow fun. The second one's terrible. Okay, that's kind of annoying. That's just, it doesn't even look like an exit. Just go right. It's just the... Alright. All right! <laughs> Every stage is all right. <laughs> it's all right. There's actually a stage that's, uh, that's up. Like this one, actually. But I was up? thinking of another one. Yeah. You just go up. Yeah, for some reason I'm liking this better now than I was just last keep going time. up. Because you got that, you got that mindset. I think you so. that old school mindset. Yeah, I think I, you just need the old school mindset to play these games sometimes. Because if you if you don't, you're just like, where's the fucking, where's where? How do I get to prestige? <laughs> prestige. How do I get to level fifty prestige? I don't know. I'm just. Fucking... <laughs> what is prestige? I don't know. It's like in Call of Duty when you like get to the final level and then you go again and you're like prestige. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> where's I've watched your progress and I'm glad that I shall be the one to put it into your petty crusade. <laughs> hey, who's you? Who are you to say it's petty? Come on. <laughs> yeah. What the hell? You think yours is better? Yeah, I think it's pretty righteous. All you do is flap around. I'm shooting things. And breaking statues. God damn it. In a beautiful field, thank you. <laughs> breaking beautiful architecture with my head. Oh god, what is this? Yeah, that was some like Mega Man X sound effect. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, it was! It was like it. <laughs> I think you fight this guy a couple times. It gets harder every time. Do you ever get a fucking non lame weapon in this game? Yeah, you do. Okay. You, you, yeah, you do. You get really cool. Really weapons. slow fireball. And yeah. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it was like intentional to make you kind of hate it because you do get better weapons. Oh, okay. To make you hate it. Yeah. 
and you're like, oh, we'll get something better, and then you do, and you're like, yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's, that's exactly what I wanted. Did you, did you, did you... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, damn, come on, man. You got him. <laughs> I'm like loading, what is that? <laughs> I think it's just to make it more intense. It's like their 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 version of a cutscene. You do seem to possess strength. People have been talking. Wow, what have they been saying? Tell me. Next time on Game Run. What's it? one two about? Three. I look forward to our next encounter. Me too, guys. What Go did ahead. he say before about? Huh? Check out the last episode, and you'll find out. Hey, dude, let's get his poop. He's Why would you do that? <laughs> you have found the crest of Earth. With it, you can morph into G Gargoyle and gain great speed. The strike to break stone... I can already break stone statues. No, but these are different stone statues. Oh, dear. These are stone statues that oh. are harder than your head, mm. believe it or not. Mm. So you just want to fly to the... You can look at the map and look at where you need to go, but... This is a Mode 7-ass shit. Yeah, right you can here. go anywhere. It's like Final Fantasy VI. Oh, yeah, just land right there. Yeah, oh, like, right, right, right there. Let's go ahead. Are you serious? Yeah, just here, land right? anywhere. You can go anywhere. Are you joking? No. You just land wherever you want. Okay, you're just sucking my dick right now? You can you got wings, you can fly wherever you <laughs> want to go. Thank you. So well, you I mean, can you can jump and headbutt if you wanna like get stuff from the windows and stuff. What is this game? Simon's Quest? Yeah. This looks like Simon's Quest. I haven't seen you around here before. Are you a stranger? stranger? No. Yes. <laughs> you're the red demon fire branch game for the call to you. Or that general Arbus hunting up down. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Bye. Yeah. Uh, that, that was really nice of you to tell me. I'm going to leave now. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do what I was going to already do. Here, go ahead and change to your uh, ground mode. Doesn't this look like Simon's Quest to you? Yeah, it does. This is actually the first thing I thought when I played this. Okay, I don't know how to do. Yeah, go oh. ahead and do a bit of crest power and ground gargoyle, and there you go. Now you're ground gargoyle. What the fuck? You got like ground ability, and you ground can ground ability. Uh, yeah, ground ability, and you can uh, you can dash. You can do a little dashy do. Can I? Yeah, I don't remember how to do it, but you can do can it. Can I do that? Yeah, you can do a little dashy do. It's one of the buttons. There you oh, go. there it is. It, right. it, it, breaks, it breaks stones okay, and didn't... shit. But not those. <laughs> it breaks stones, isn't that cool? But not those. Those stones are better than you. For now. Okay, alright. So now you got groundy goo. You can, uh, you can, well, you can get hurt by that. But you can also push it if you want. Can I? Yeah, you can push it out of the way. It's uh, already out of the way. Well, some of them are in the way. Is this so, like... Kind of Castlevania -y. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. It's like dark. It's got that purple. It's got that Super Nintendo purple. Yeah, and it's got that, that merman and all that. I love games that look like this. Ah! Ah! I think there's a door behind those ghouls. Or behind that statue. Oh, let me dispel these. Yeah, like, the thing about him is that he can, like, shoot, like, a bunch of fireballs when he jumps. Yeah. And they're, like, pretty strong. With this guy? Yeah. No, he can't. Yeah, he can shoot, like, a couple, I think. No, he can't. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I guess that was when, like, they disappeared, then you could do it again. Really oh, quickly. yeah, I guess you can't with the other guy? Yeah, I think so. I think I remember something about him being stronger. Oh, shit. Oh, God, did I just go into a bones? Yeah. Well, you're a firebrand. What does that mean? Well, didn't you read the pamphlet? No. About firebrand? No. You're talking about the guy, the guy who was married to Katy Perry? I gave you the fucking... You gave me the pamphlet. You're talking about the guy who was married to Katy Perry? I'm talking about... Rusty Brand? Yeah, Russell Brand. Is Rusty, that what you're saying? No, they call him Rusty because he's a good friend. Oh. You know what he told me the other day? What did he say? He said, I didn't even love her. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what he said? And I was like, dude, that's fucking harsh. Like, did he did he say that about Katy Perry? Yeah, he did. He said I didn't even love her. No. Oh. <laughs> he did to me though. Oh, he did to you? Not publicly. It's a secret, so I probably shouldn't have said it out loud. I'm sorry, say, Russell Brand. I was gonna say it sounds like something Russell Brand. Rusty, I mean, say. Rusty. He's a good. He's a good guy. He's a good guy aside from the fact that he doesn't even love Katy Perry. Like, in that aspect, I can be like, dude, you're kind of a dick. But like, otherwise, it's like, hey, he's nice. He bought me dinner a couple times. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. So there's a door behind that statue. Is there? Yeah. Why are you, you should, you should the push it. The game? So you can go there. You push it with your dash. Oh, with the dash. Yeah. Oh. Now the things are becoming clear. Yep. Also, you're becoming queer. <laughs> no. I don't want to know. Is that what you want to become, John? It is scary. Is that in the future? Is that what you want? It is scary. It is scary. What? Okay, well. You're like some kid. He's like, he just like sees that and he's like, 
oh my god. And he like goes to his mom and she's like, what do you want to be when you grow up? And he's like, I want to be the crawly guy. <laughs> I want to be that. Just, you could have broke will, that will, thing. Will I become that, mom? <laughs> No, uh, not not. Of the, course not. Well, you're like you'll oh. look like that, but you won't be moving. <laughs> luckily, yeah, you'll be dead. <laughs> you'll be dead, and everyone you love will be yeah. dead, including us. We'll die way before you. <laughs> we'll die way before you. Don't worry about that. We won't be here to see that shit. So you get to live with the agony of us not being in your life forever. Mm. Just, just provoke him again. <laughs> I'm non-confrontational, Aaron. <laughs> you gotta let him come out of his little fire goo. There you go. Alright, there we go. Jeez, that was harder than expected. Ah, I got it! You know, that. What is that? I used the money to buy, like, spells and shit. So you have, like, three different upgrades you can do. Like, you, you have your type, and then you can choose, like, which different attack you have for that type. Yeah. And then there's something else that I forgot. <laughs> How about that? Stepping on- oh, god. He just melts in That's the sand. Disgusting. Sorry. This whole game is disgusting. Yeah, it is. It is a bit. It's a little too mature. It has. It has cool sprites. No, 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 no. Go back. Go back. Dash into that. Great. It's stuff. It's money. You don't want money. Everybody well, wants money. Dude, money is what the evil of the world is. Evil because of money. No, time is money. Uh, all those are cliches. No, t time is money. Oh. No, I'm saying that they found out, like... <laughs> no, I'm saying scientifically, they no, yeah, like time they, is they, money. They found the Higgs boson, and they realized that time is money. <laughs> Higgs boson, the fucking trump card for any fucking scientific conversation. Yeah. Uh, no, 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 you don't understand the fucking Higgs boson. Like, <laughs> oh, You're right, I don't understand the Higgs boson, neither the fucking you, clearly. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I remember we had, a, we had a Higgs boson party the first time they yeah, thought we did, it, was gonna, it was gonna be unveiled. And, uh... We had a physicist friend that like explained it to us, and guess what? what? I don't fucking remember any of it. I was paying really close attention too. I was like, "All right, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna learn this. I'm gonna learn what the Higgs boson is." Do, you, do they actually? Did you remember at the time if you understood what they were saying? Yeah, like at the time, I was like, "Yeah, okay, that makes sense because of that and that." But now it's just like, uh, I don't know. Higgs boson doesn't it mean that we're gonna get better plasma screen televisions. I hope so. In the future, LED baby, <laughs> QLED. It's like, LED. It's like what they're doing at the fucking uh, what's it CERN? <laughs> they're, doing, they're just like they're just like we found the Higgs boson. Everyone's like, woo! All LED, baby! <laughs> Low latency gaming! <laughs> Low latency gaming! <laughs> Fuck yeah! We don't need any of that scaling shit, <laughs> bro. It's gonna be like arcade days again. <laughs> yeah! Yo, somebody turn off that particle collider. <laughs> shit, it's using all the power. We can't run our arcade, dog. I want to play Time Crisis too. <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck is this? Like, Soldier Boy? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, wh what does that sound like? It sounds like somebody. It sounds like Soldier Boy. Ain't got no point to the game. Ain't no point to the game. Don't you know so- I was thinking about that. Don't you know Soldier Boy? Uh, well, I don't know him, but he's a- he's a fan. That's weird. He used to be a Newgroundser. <laughs> really? Yeah, he made a couple cartoons. They're still up there. You can watch them. <laughs> really? Yeah. Soldier Boy was a Newgrounds? Yeah. Um, so he was like a big fan of like the the old Newgrounds guys, old school Newgrounds guys. He's also a fan of Ross. Is he cool? Um, I mean, <laughs> I don't know him, so I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't want to put you on the spot. But he, he seems cool. No, I'm I'm being serious. Uh, no, I'm just saying. I, I've never like spoken to him like personally. I just <laughs> he seems like a cool. <laughs> When, uh, when Awesome Reach came out, I was just kind of was like, uh, and I was like, hey, Soldier Boy, did you check out my new cartoon? And he was like, and then he retweeted it, and I was like, yeah, because he has like two million followers. <laughs> yeah, he's fucking Soldier Boy, that, that one song. Yeah. Superman that bitch. And, and crank that, crank that, Soldier Boy. F fuck that bitch in the ass. Crank Do not that. respect that woman. <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite song. That one? Yeah. In particular? That woman does not deserve equal rights. I thought that your Put favorite your song... Put your dick in her ass. I thought your favorite song was... What are you gonna even do? What are you I gonna... like dudes. Yeah. Yippity yappity dudes. Yippity <laughs> yappity. I like dudes. Yippity yappity Well, you said, you said that you didn't relate to the lyrics, but you at least liked the way that they said them. Like, that song had a good melody. You know, I'm gonna just go ahead and remind you that you're not funny, and I don't find you funny, and many who do find you funny are generally lying. You mean things here? You're me off like off this show right now? Or <laughs> do you want me to fucking do this part for you? No! 
I got it, dude. It's just, not really fucking way too hard or anything. You just gotta, you just gotta light the candles and get all the way to the right before they go out. Won't you light my candle? Just go, just fucking just go. The, just go. Can you not step on the chandelier? Wait, no. Oh. You can fly. I'm. I thought you could step on the chandelier. You can fly, though. What does that matter? Stop, because you can fly. All right, quit fucking quoting Peter Pan to me and let me finish this fucking game. If you haven't noticed, those ghouls with the creepy mouths, they, yeah, eat, they, they eat the flames. Oh, fucking asshole. <laughs> All right, there you go. You're good. Ah, oh. I go in the door. I could have figured that it was there. I don't think you can go through if it's invisible. All right, this is the first, like... <laughs> I mean, get used to that, because that's the no. whole game. No! Yeah. Okay, let's do what happens. Are you okay? No, don't! Well, you saw for yourself. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. Ready? I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. Ready? Here we go! Get ready to go up. Excuse me, though? Excuse me? Excuse me, Bob. He's a glooby glob. That's a very inaccurate description of him. How was this? How like how was this creature born? What is that? What am I getting there? What, what was it? I didn't see it. It was like a fire bubble. Oh, I don't fucking know. <laughs> oh, I'll figure out later, I, I guess. Don't know. It's start. Uh, spells. You don't have any though. <laughs> I guess it's a power up you don't have yet. Is so this mouse? is really fucking hard. This this boss is really fucking hard. Is it? Yeah. I don't believe it. You gotta hit the eyes. You gotta dot the eyes and Yeah, it's hard. And like if you sink it's it's hard. And you, you have to hit each eyeball twice. Aaron, I'm starting to get an impression that it's hard. No, it's really difficult. I remember having a Watch me beat it in one try. I would love that, to be honest. Because then you would prove to me that you're just the better gamer. I hate that term. What the better gamer? No, just gamer. Yeah, well, me too. It's like when people talk about, like, immersion in games, it's like, I hate that too. Why? I don't know. Yeah, it's just such an overused word. This game's got great immersion. It's like, what's that mean? It means... It means immersion? It, it puts you in the world. It, yeah, it makes you feel like you're there. It makes you... Just, no game does that. Yeah, they do. Like what? Like, uh... Fallout 3, Skyrim. It doesn't make you feel like you're there, it makes you feel like you're playing a video game in a cool level. Well, this is you have no imagination. <laughs> Fuck's sake. World of Warcraft is an immersive game. It's, no, a, it's a game that makes you forget it has boundaries and there's a world outside of it. Like Skyrim, World of Warcraft, Fallout 3, fucking Bioshock, fucking anything. They're all immersive. I disagree. Okay. I think, you know what's immersive to me? What? Fucking like... Disney World. Yeah, that's immersive too. Because you're there. Yeah, but it's still the same concept. It's not real. I just don't get it. Don't I don't get home. immersed in that. It's it's always I a game to you. me. I, I, if a world like fleshed out and interesting, and you want to like have a part in it, that's fine. I don't consider that immersive though, because I never feel like I'm there. I'm you know gonna beat I mean? this jelly bean. I don't want to seem cynical, although I completely do, at the moment. <laughs> He's fucking hard, dude. Yeah, he f follows you, and he shoots his little goop out of his pupil. <laughs> that's gross. Yeah, that's fucking gross. Uh, so it's not actually an eye. Well, it's it it's like a mouth or something, and it just looks like an eye. No, it's an eye. It's just... But he's shooting goop out of it. So? Eyes don't have that function. I don't think any eyes have that function. Eyes, eyes, baby. Fire. Maybe it's like a penis. Where, I where semen and urine come out of the same hole. So maybe there's like two tubes. Yeah, well, there's one tube for vision and then another tube for, for goop. It's a little different. One, it doesn't do either of those things. Well, this, yeah, it shoots out goop. Penises don't see or well, they shoot goop, but it's not green goop. That hurts. Well, I mean, it hurts <laughs> when green goop comes out. Well, it, hurts. it hurts if you don't want it, I guess. Yeah, that's it hurts true. you at the core. <laughs> at the core. <laughs> it hurts you at the core. Like of your being. I imagine it would, yeah. <laughs> like your ego and everything, you'd just be like, oh shit, I'm peeing green goop. <laughs> oh no. You're what? 
What is, what, is, what is the world gonna think of me? What is my boss gonna think when I tell him I'm peeing green goo? No, no, that's not what I'm saying. Yeah, it's like a really nosy no, boss, so it's like, I can't not. come into work today, I'm sick. And he's like, what's wrong? And it's like, I'm just sick. And he's like, well, you gotta tell me or else I'm just gonna think you're lying. It's a green goo. No, dude. that's not what I was talking about. <laughs> I was saying, I was saying, never mind, just never mind. <laughs> you mean your, your, like, your core, like, physically? No, like, like, if you got jizzed on and you didn't want to get jizzed on, uh -huh. I said it, I said, I said jizz doesn't, okay, I was saying the green goop hurts you, uh -huh. but jizz doesn't hurt you if you get jizzed on, unless you don't want to be jizzed on, and it hurts you, but, like, at your core. Oh, I see. But who wouldn't want to be jizzed on? Somebody who wasn't in the mood to be jizzed on. No, that does that happen? <laughs> well, I guess maybe you've been a lucky man. Oh, very lucky. I've had to deal with so many court cases. B being jizzed on or you doing the jizzing? <laughs> well, isn't that for me to know and you to know from the papers? I don't read the paper. You're going to have to cliff note me. <laughs> I... I was in jail for 27 years, wrongfully accused of jizzing on the princess. Wait, you're 23. I've been in jail for a long fucking time, dude. I got out and started doing game crows. Was it like a hyperbolic time chamber? Yeah, you just, no. You just stayed in there forever? A reverse hyperbolic time chamber? Where you, you don't age when you're in it? Huh? This is hard. Hold I, on. Yeah. You really gotta focus and not think about jizz right focus? now. Focus? <laughs> yeah, just... Well, oh, you did it. Be. Wow. Did you have more than two tries on this guy? Uh, no, I, I fought him a bunch. So, good work. Thank you. You did it. Thank you. Do you want to try some of this wonderful game? No, go ahead. Okay. Cool, you got your Blasty Bloof. Alright. This is where... You got the Blasty Bloof. Yeah, this is where you're, you're gonna start having, a, like, a super good time. It's called Buster? Yeah. Like Megaman? Yeah, like Megaman. Alright. Now you're getting it. Uh, is this a place? Yeah, it gives you like some money, and you can buy some upgrades or whatever. Right. This is cool, this is flying. Yeah. Go in there. They can't go in the water, dude. What? You can't have a little beach visit. <laughs> what is this, a fucking granary? It'll scare everybody. Come on. This world is really depressing. What? Just Everywhere purple. in the world, it's just purple and... You can't go in here. Oh, there you go. Fun. Well, it's a fucking Castlevania world. Alright. Where's Buster? So, uh, equip it. Yeah. There we go. I think you can charge it, maybe? No. You, you can just shoot two. So, yeah, there you go. Alright, we got it on the roll here. Now you got a move that you like. Okay, does it work with the ground? So, this is different. This is like the ground thing? No, this is just for fire. Wait. So, you can't. No, use but that's it the ground one. Yeah. Oh, that's crest power and fire power. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm like already dead. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Uh, not really. Why? Well, because if you stay dead, then you <laughs> can't Why? die anymore. Why? <laughs> well, there's a lot of reasons. Wait, what are those things to the, to the, to the top right? They're like upgrades or something that you can equip. You start to get them. This game, like, gets pretty in-depth. I, I think there's, like, branching paths in this game, too. There's branching paths? Yeah, because I... I beat this really quickly when I played it last, and I think there were like levels I was missing, so I think it's like just different every time you play. Maybe not, I don't know, maybe it's just a short game. Either way, I had a lot of fun with it. So go to the left. Oh boy. <laughs> Grab that face. Stop barfing. I can't, this is really hard. Yeah, it is. Oh. There you go. Now you get to this. Now I'm playing with... Ah, stop. So yeah, the buster busts those bricks. Oh. Yeah. Oh. So they call Let it the buster. Let me tell you something, buster. Yes? No. Let me tell you something, buster. I wish they would bring your show back. <laughs> what? Uh, Tiny Toons. Bust oh, buster. Buster Bunny. Buster and Babs Bunny, no relation. I can't fucking do this. Is really fucking hard. Do you want to do this? Sure. I actually never understood that as a kid. What? Buster and Babs no relation? Yeah, I was like, what does that mean? Because I was a stupid kid. Hmm. Because they're bunnies? Well, because they have the, la the same last name. Buster, Bunny, and Babs. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought it was just because they were really similar looking in bunnies. 
that they would say that. <laughs> yeah, it was like such an adult show. Yeah, that show's awesome. Tiny Toons. I should go back and watch some of it. Yeah, you should. It's, it's got the same quality as Animaniacs. Dead. I remember that. That's a good show. Do you remember the like TV special they did? It was like the summer vacation or whatever. No. Really? No, I don't remember. It was a big deal. Was it? Yeah. Because it was like a. It was like an hour long. It was like a real movie. Like how I spent my summer vacation or something. Uh, was it like anything like how I met your mother? I think there was like a point in it where I like realized I was turning into like a zombie, a post-pubescent boy. Yeah. Because uh, like I don't know, there was like a scene where like Babs was in a bathing suit or something, and I was like, mm -hmm. really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, what that, is what is this feeling? That that totally does happen. Yeah. And it's weird because it's like, why does that stuff? It's it's all it's all in our brains. Why would a Babs bunny in a bathing suit turn anyone on? <laughs> well, come on, man, just give, it, give her some more credit. Next time I'm, I'm gonna apologize to Babs bunny publicly because I don't know, I don't want to lose that connection. See you guys later. Are we really getting Babs bunny on the show? Mm, yeah. I'll come back to Game Grow. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> because you gotta tell them to get back here somehow. <laughs> like if we never welcome them back, they just show up and there's no welcome, and they'd be like. What? What? What the fuck, man? <laughs> it's just like, what, you think, do, you, like do, you, do you even know we're here? It's like when you get like invited somewhere, and the the person doesn't acknowledge you. Oh, like like by that person? What do you? What, like you get invited well, somewhere they by they that stopped, person? They stopped that shit in the fucking like 1600s, 1800s. I don't actually know when slavery was abolished. Oh, <laughs> like by that? I got you. <laughs> Gotcha. When was slavery abolished? Uh, I don't know. They started fighting against it with Abraham Lincoln, so... When was he? Was he 16? He was 16. Si when he was 16 years old when he decided he wanted to become president. Yeah. Also, ironically, 16th president. It was 16th, right? The 16th president? Yeah. Uh, I have no fucking clue, dude. 16th or 14th or some shit. Yeah, I don't know. Um... But yeah, he was the... He was kind of the one that was like, Hey... You should probably stop... With that shit... And then the Civil War? Right? The Civil... <laughs> I'm no. sorry, are you asking my opinion on this? No, is it true? What do you the, mean? The, the Civil War was like the... the we Civil want War. slaves! And the other people were like, we don't want slaves. Uh, yes! I want to say yes, and I think that was the seventh... Let's look this up. When was slavery abolished? I don't know that the Civil War was over slavery. Don't ask, don't ask Siri though, because she kind of still has a soft spot for that. Dude, I asked Siri. I said, "Open the pod bay doors, Hal," to Siri, and she's like, "Listen, open the pod bay doors, Siri." Sorry, John, I don't do pod bay doors. Fine, wait. Open the pod bay doors, Hal. You would think someone would have opened it by now. She said some other thing earlier that was like <laughs> she she was she made a like space joke. She was like, if I did that, it was surely would be breathtaking or something. <laughs> breathtaking. Yeah. Oh, she Siri, you cheeky bitch. She's a cheeky bitch. She is. She's a little bit cheeky. It says January 1st, 1863. 1863, there 1863. you go. 1863. Yeah, what's wrong with that? I don't know. Let's see. When did the Civil War start? I'm curious. Let's teach some people on the show. Let's have some history, guys. Do you want some history? Everyone's like, fuck no. And everyone's like, dude, I, wanna, I came here to fucking, I just came from history class to watch your stupid show. They're gonna try to teach me about the American Civil War. I guess like 1861. Okay, I guess it was right after. It was, I guess, I guess it was what that was about. What the Civil War was about slavery? Or, I don't know. I actually don't know what the Civil War was about. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was about slavery. Um, I don't do history, apparently. I know some shit. I'm like, when I was a kid, they told me Christopher Columbus uh, directed the movie Rent. And it was very good. It was a very good movie he made. He also did a couple of Harry Potters, and then they switched him out for some other guy. Oh wow! So all that was just a remake. Yeah, dude. Turns out the West Indies it didn't even matter. He made a billion dollars off his other shit. Well, it's good. Well, good for him. Good. For it's a real, real American dream story. <laughs> I mean, he came here to find 
fucking Indies and he found the American dream. <laughs> Chris Columbus came here to find the West Indies, found the American dream. Just find like a movie trailer or something. <laughs> <laughs> Christopher Soon. Columbus was a young man. <laughs> Ready to fly. Uh, did that, that song, I don't know what it is, but it was in the Elizabeth Town trailer. I don't know what the fuck that movie is. It's some stupid ass chick flick ass movie about the cemetery. El- Elizabeth? Yeah, Elizabeth Town. I don't fucking know. The trailer came out like a zillion times when it came out. And then there's a part when that song comes on, it's like, Ready to fly. And it's just like the perfect like fucking like trailer song like I really do love you. <laughs> I don't even know if this is the fucking lyrics. And then if it's a comedy, it has to be um, it has to be like some like really dated pop song. <laughs> what is that? Like like uh, what are some like something that came out like five years ago? You know, some pop song. I'm trying to think of one. Is it is it just a pop song? No, 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 just like any pop song that yeah, okay, came out so like, like five years ago. Mm, a pop song came out like five years ago. That was like really popular and just vanished into obscurity because it was so stupid. Mm-hmm. Like like back in the day, it was like who let the dogs out? Yeah, who like, let the dogs like, out was a the, fucking huge contender. Like that caliber of song. What about what about um um? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on I got it. What about um? My own worst enemy. It's no surprise to me. No, no. Well, we talked about this once on the show. No, 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 not that one. Okay, a, a pop song came no, out. No, no, like a pop, not a, not, right. not a rock song, like a, a pop, pop song, song that came out like five mm-hmm. years ago. Not a rock pop song. Mm-hmm. I gotta use Buster. Dang, what, what what year was that? Like that was like two thousand. That was like two thousand and eight. What? Like two thousand and eight ish. For what? This era. Oh, the era. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I guess so. Damn, all I can think of was like. Lady Gaga or something. When did she come out? Like 2009? Lady Gaga started becoming a thing around 2009? Yeah. Isn't it weird when you think just how little Lady Gaga's been around? Yeah. Plus how she just like vanished. She hasn't really vanished. You say like Lady Gaga and you're like, oh yeah, Lady Gaga. You know? What? Like you used to hear her in like every fucking... It seemed like she was like, dude, fucking Lady Gaga's the new shit. I mean, she was. She is still... But... You you just think about it now and you're like Lady oh, Gaga. Oh, I haven't like you used to go oh, to yeah. every coffee shop well, and hear fucking paparazzi. You know you, they, they still play her songs a lot. I, I don't like her poppy stuff as much as her. I, Born This Way is the is the album I really like. Fame Monster is okay. Fame Monster has like what Bad Romance and uh, what else is on Fame Monster? Fame Monster is my favorite album. Do you really like it better than Born This Way? Yeah, I don't really like Born That Way. I, I, way that I don't know why people hate on Lady Gaga. I think she's fucking amazing. <laughs> Oh, her poppy stuff's annoying though, I have to admit, like the fucking telephone song or whatever. And I get oh, get my telephone's like okay, I get Telephone's it. cool. Really you like those songs? Yeah. I like Starstruck. It's a good song. Starstruck's awesome. Oh, you know what song's fucking awesome? I think it's over in this way. Speechless. Oh, oh baby, I'm speechless. I'm speechless. I, I, dude, I can listen to the, I can listen to Born This Way like front to back and I just love the whole thing. I love it. It's so good. I don't know. Shit. I think Lady Gaga is really. I think people will come to appreciate her in time. She's one of those people. I think she's one of those bands people look back and go like, oh, she actually was better than we gave her credit for. I, I don't know. People I hate on her. I don't know that really. I think so personally. I don't think people hate on her. The only the only reason I criticize Lady Gaga at all is that it's like it's like oh man she's a real artist and it's like uh, Lady Gaga Cityville too. It's like they don't do uh, that. Yeah, they did. That's a big promotion. They. That's how. We, whatever. Well, what, it's, it's, we if she's, do that. If she's cl- yeah, but I'm not <laughs> claiming that I'm an artist as a result of that. Yes, yeah, kind of. What do you mean, artist? What, why is it? Why? Because everyone's like, oh, she's so revolutionary. Why it's are like, artists? Lady Gaga and Zenga team okay. up to make Gagaville. And why? Like, why are okay. artists and why are artists and commercialism mutually exclusive? I don't understand that. In the sense that fucking Cityville, like how is Cityville art? Whatever, they're just taking her fucking name and putting it on Cityville. It doesn't change the shit she did. And then her fucking perfume, where it's like, have you seen the commercial for the perfume that no. she did? It's like, it, it's like one of those like art house, like right. children's, you know, like college art school film student kind of things where it's like, what are you even just stop? Well, all that happened. 
Or, oh. or like, uh, the fucking, sorry, but what? <laughs> this is why, like the fucking, like, Alejandro music video, you know that one? I love that music video. The music video for Alejandro? It's awesome! It's fucking stupid! What do you mean stupid? It's awesome! It's just silly and random! It's a music video! They're silly and random! I hate music videos, too. Well, uh, okay, fucking short of Michael Jackson, who makes music videos that aren't just silly and random? Uh... I just um, consider music videos fucking eye tech demos. Good question. They're all just silly, they're, they're just... They just use them like cinematography tech demos, practically. It's just like, what if we just did a bunch of this shit? And they do it. It's whatever. I don't like that, is do you, my point, I guess. Uh, well, the, but the, I'm, I'm not really talking about the music video. I'm talking about the song. I like the fucking song. The songs are great. The, that's all I'm fucking talking about! Okay. I'm not criticizing. I'm Lady. Listen, I didn't say. I didn't fucking say that Lady Gaga was bad. Oh, okay. Well, I know you. I was just saying that the reason I would criticize her is because all her shit is way too like. Okay, stop. Like that's just not even. It's not even artsy. It's like you're just pushing the envelope. Uh, there's value to that in some ways. No, I don't think so. It's too like. All right, somebody pushes the envelope and then the people mellow it out. I don't think that... Because it just doesn't make sense. And then people try to, like, dissect it, and it's like, there's no dissecting it. It's just weird and silly. You can't dissect any fucking art. Sure you can. Listen to fucking I Am The Walrus. They, I know they did that on purpose to piss people off. But still... And what's the point of dissecting it? I just like it when there's some fucking... I don't Something dissect it. I'm not saying I do. No, I'm just saying, like... I, well, so, okay, you're just, okay, okay, what, what it sounds like right now is that you're basing your lady, well, that was fucking pro, you're basing your Lady Gaga shit off of what other people do with her work or think about her work. I'm just talking about it. No, I'm objective. talking about her music videos. But you said people try to dissect it and that's why you don't like it. No, I didn't say that at all. No. <laughs> okay, are we just doing that now? <laughs> <laughs> it was just funny because it just keeps being like, no, no. That's not what I was saying. <laughs> what were you saying? I was just saying that it's weird. All right, whatever. It's weird and it doesn't make sense. <laughs> Do you want to just not be I don't anymore? fucking like it. <laughs> Do you want to just like it just go? I don't like it when people are like, wow, what an artist, and it's like, no, it's <laughs> it's stupid. You don't consider yourself an artist? I do in the sense of when I make art. What does that mean, Aaron? What did you just say? Because I make art. When I make art, I consider myself an artist. But What's like, art? When I'm playing you? video games and talking over, I don't consider myself an artist. I, I don't either. Well, I don't like the term artist in general. Whatever. I person. I never is art. said she's a fucking artist. I didn't. I, I didn't say you did. I was just saying the only reason I would criticize Lady Gaga is for that. <laughs> hey, I, I think communication. I think her. I'm also miscommunication. I think her music is fine. Lady. It's catchy. <laughs> Lady Gaga wins. Pop part is. <laughs> John gets a new fucking co-host. Don't do it. <laughs> oh my god! What is today? <laughs>